Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to create a shipping policy for your Shopify store as well as implement it onto your website for your visitors to actually look at it. So basically in this video, we're gonna go ahead and show you guys how to do that. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into today's video. So what you're gonna wanna go ahead and do, stay on the Shopify home screen, and then what you're gonna wanna do now is navigate to the bottom left-hand corner of your screen to the Settings tab. Now go ahead and click on the Settings tab and navigate all the way down to the bottom of the Options list right here where it says Policies. Now from the policies, you guys can see right here, there are a bunch of policies you can actually create here from template and much more. So basically, the only thing that doesn't, you know, can't be created from template is the shipping policy. So you're going to want to go ahead and give your shipping policy, you know, basically what your shipping policy is, right? So just create your shipping policy. You can actually get some maybe inspiration from other shipping policies and much more. So basically, just go ahead and create the shipping policy. And once you are actually done from creating this shipping policy, you're going to want to head over to the save and go ahead and save your shipping policy. Now, basically, now that our shipping policy has now been created, you're going to want to head back to the Shopify home screen. So basically, right now, we are currently on that and you want to go ahead and implement the shipping policy on your store just for your visitors to actually go ahead and see. So basically, how you do that is you're going to want to go ahead and click online store. And from online store, you're going to want to head over to navigation right below pages. So basically, click on navigation and you're going to want to go ahead and click on main menu so basically right here from main menu you guys can see that there's home catalog contact and an add menu item you're gonna want to go ahead and click on add menu item and you're gonna want to head over below name and go to link you're gonna want to head over to link and below blog post you guys can see that policies are right here so go ahead and click on policies and you guys can see that shipping policy is actually right here so go ahead and import that and go ahead and add it and save the changes so you guys can see that the menu has now been updated and reflections are going to take a little bit of time to actually show up on your website so basically we're going to head over to our online store and go ahead and check that out now basically you guys can see that at the top of our website the shipping policy is actually active and it says right here seven a days no refund in package so that's how you know that the shipping policy has actually worked and that's pretty much how you go ahead and implement and add and shipping policy to your website guys and also create one so without further ado guys that's been it for today's video hopefully you guys found this video extremely helpful guys and if you guys want more tutorials leave a comment down below what tutorials you do want and other than that guys if you guys haven't already drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel and comment down below what you guys thought of the video and i'll go ahead and see you guys for the next video